everything that we see on screen, I think, I mean, it came from a lot of it was like Nadine and myself talking about, you know, that scene for weeks and weeks and weeks before it. So I think it was a combination of just um, really good direction on, on, on Nadine's part and, um, and also uh, her and I being on the same page, talking everything through, knowing kind of, I mean, I mean, knowing where it goes from the moment it happens to the moment it ends, you know. So, uh, um, but it's like any, it's any, like any other, it's like any other scene. It's like you know, if it's a comedy scene, you know, you kind of know, you kind of know like what beats you have to hit um, from beginning to end, and you know that it has to it has to achieve some kind of arc or you know direction or something. So. Um, so it's kind of like learning lines, basically, except it's all visual. Right? Yeah, yeah. You know, you're trying to hit beats in any scene, and I think that that one was just a little more nuanced, maybe in the face. But um, and it was a lot of it was internal, maybe. You know, just kind of like going through, going through like the psychology of that of that scene. You know. So then you started like connecting with Wang Fu. Yeah. I think you produced Agents of Secret stuff. Weren't you like one of the producers? Yeah, I was one of the producers on that, yeah. So, so what got you connected with them and deciding, oh, let me do producing now too? Well, um, I always did a little bit of producing, um, some writing and then acting. And then with them, I got involved with them because I uh, um, came into the whole new media thing pretty late. But once I once I once I was there, I just kind of realized I I, I want I really want to get into this. Like, I want to new media is totally fascinating to me. So I wanted to get into it as as far as I could, into as much as I could. And that's why I've been so involved with them, you know, um, recently. And you've been doing some comedy too, right? Yeah. And then they, you know, I was like really obsessed with being cool for a very long time when I started out. And that's like the thing that messes you up with this industry is like you're trying to be something you're not and I thought I was cool for a long time and I was trying to be cool and then when I hooked up with Wang Fu was when I realized you know it's okay to be a, you know a dork which is who I am and so I, I, I just it, it just opened up the, it opened up the, the world to me because I was finally free of trying to be cool which I'm not obviously so you know it was like it was, it's like it, it, was, it was it was like getting involved with Wang Fu is probably one of the best things that, that happened to me you know is there something in the works with Wang Fu right now? Yeah, yeah, we're we're working on two web series, um, one for AT and T, and then one for um, it's like a, an original web series. It's an, an original Wang Fu web series. So I'm I'm writing that stuff with them, and then developing like a, a feature a feature film with them. Yeah, because they just got an award. Yeah. Yeah. So you're gonna be involved in that too? Well, I mean, I'm just writing their their coattails. So uh, <laughs> whatever. Stephanie Muiko. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's called Casual. It's a it's a relationship drama. It's not a straight up drama. There's some like really light moments. Oh, so you'll do her drama, but not mine. Um, the lot a lot of the scenes that uh, I'm involved in. She, well, uh, Tiffany, uh, t uh, Tiffany, the star and the producer of that short carries a lot of the drama, and then I'm I, I do a lot of the comic relief actually. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So. Uh, she does a lot of the heavy lifting for the drama stuff, and then I am like the bumbling, you know, dude who doesn't know what's going on. But um, there's some pretty cool relationship uh, themes that it discusses, and it's it's really good. But it's not a straight up drama. I would definitely categorize it as a dramedy, somewhat on on that on that like boundary, you know, drama. I like how you're trying to cover yourself. I know. If you see it, you'll be like, okay, he's yeah, Chris is the bumbling.